Yo, what is up and what's going on? It's your boy D Wild TV coming at you with another video. And today, man, this video is sponsored by Aha Low Key. It's sponsored by Mystery Tackle Box, man. Big shouts out to Mystery Tackle Box for sending over two boxes, man, to try out. So what we're gonna try to do is the Pro MTB box, the MTB Slam. Y'all know what we're talking about here, man. So, and what I do want to let you guys know is, um. You can probably win these if uh, you just stay tuned towards this video. Just stay tuned, man, to the end of this video. Please do not skip out. Let's see what's up in this box, man. And hopefully, we can go around this beautiful reservoir and catch us some fish, man. Y'all just stay tuned, man. It's DYL TV. Boom. So, look, man. We're going to crack open this mess. We're going to crack open this mystery tackle box, bro. If I slur, I'm so sorry. Y'all know I can't speak, man. Once again, big shouts out to Mystery Tackle Box for sending this over, man. I can't tell you how thankful I am. Were you using the, oh, you using a, uh, just a regular frog. I thought he was using that Lunker Hunt prop frog that we used in the last video, but he wasn't. But we're going to crack this thing over, man. You got a knife on you, dog? Negative. Negative. You know what? We can get it open. We can definitely get this thing open. Because you know what? We have to get some keys to get it open. Oh, that's true. I got my keys in my, in my pocket right here. <laughs> Here we go, man. And listen, I did not open this package. So can we get some hype in the comments, bro? Like, that's, that's, that's really crazy. I really did want to open this thing up as soon as it came in. But I messed up my finger here. And this is the first time that I get to fish in like a week now. So I'm really excited that I get to fish. I'm just like trying to take my time as I fish. And I'm going to try to make this a really good video for y'all. So definitely stay tuned. So we're going to get up in this box, man. I'm just really glad that I held off and didn't open it because I definitely wanted to open it. All right, boom. There we go. This is the Pro Box. Okay, 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 okay. My first look, my first look, when I first looked in this, I saw that. And I'm like, that's really good because if you see it is nothing hold on let's turn that brightness down it is nothing but chop on the water especially out there we up in this little cove right now so that definitely should do some kind of damage out here man so i don't know which ones i'm gonna tie oh my god i got a chatterbait we got a chatterbait guys turn it back down boom Check out the Z Man. And I know y'all know who rings a bell, bruh. Brian Lattimore, bruh, with the Z Man. So we got a chatterbait right there. And we got to see how much it costs, man. So which one? Chatterbait. Wow. $4.99, dog. So that's chatterbait. Dude, that is no king. <laughs> Never heard of this uh, brand, but. It cannot be bad if Mystery Tackle Box is including it. It's a really, really big, like, bulky style, pres like, the presentation. Oh, I got a bug on me. <laughs> yeah, I got one of these. You got one of these? Yeah, it's like, it's, it's a bit big, ain't it? Mine like, was a 10 foot, or a 10 uh, foot depth. Yeah? Vexen. Oh, uh, it was the, it's got the chartreuse belly with the baby blue on it. Mm. It looks real good. Let's see about this one. Oh, did you get the one from the Mystery Tackle Box? Sure enough. I actually got a Mystery Tackle Box in there. We might, decide, we, might, we might have to do a challenge. Mystery Tackle Box versus Mystery Tackle Box. Oh, this three to four foot right there. Boom, you see it. This three to four foot. So we're going to have to use this up in here, up in the pockets like right now. But it'll happen. It'll happen. We ain't rushing them. And okay, boom. Dude, those look like some freaking things like gobies or something like some fat old lizards, dude. Like. That could work though, bro, because a lot of times there's a lot of salamanders in the water that you don't know of, so I would guarantee that would be a good bait to throw up in some of this wood and stuff. And we got us a white spinner bait, bro. So many moving baits today, man. We're just going to be chucking, bro. We are going to be just chucking around, so that's really clean, bro. If I'm not mistaken, those are willow blades. Yeah, am I am I correct? Willow blades, willow blades, and those are thinner, and they have more 
They ha they spin more times than you would. What's the other kind of blade Colorado. called? Colorado blade. And the Colorado blade is like thicker. It's like it's like a little bit thicker than this, and it spins slower, but it gives off a, a harder vibration. vibration. And this one spins faster and gives off more flash. So this is really good, especially right now. Like I said, man, it's just a good time to just throw you some moving baits right now. So that's what we're gonna do, bro. Sure and for the last one, bro, and definitely not least, what is this thing? The cream. Check him out, bro. Oh, wow. That's weird, dude. It's different. They hit different. So it's like, what would you say this look like, Cole? salamander yeah like a salamander like the other one and like i'm telling y'all bro salamanders are out right now especially in creeks dude you could go to town bro so i'm not going to just waste y'all's time anymore man we're going to go ahead and throw one of these baits up on there what do we want to use what do we want to use i need a lure i'm going to start off with I'm going to start off with this. I'm probably going to just throw it up on a small shaky head. And then I'm also going to throw the spinner bait. Because I feel like the spinner bait has a good chance of calling out an aggressive fish. So we're going to start off with these two. And I'm really going to start off with this because, you know, we got to go with moving baits first. Let's go. All right, y'all. We're going to start off with the... Well, ow, it kind of hurts, bro. So I got to figure out how I'm going to fish with my sword, bro. My cut, my bruise. We're going to start off with this crankbait, bro. Throw it up in that shallow stuff because it dies four to six feet. Ow. I might want to go ahead and crush the button and help myself out. And that's like a good log cast that I can do. <laughs> Let's go. All right, y'all, man, I want to just show y'all this box. I'm really hoping this box got some terminal tackle. It's the $5 um, mystery tackle box. And we're going to do the challenge tonight, man. We're actually going night fishing. We got our brother, uh, Atypical, out here, man. Check out the evening as the sunset, man. If you don't love it, what do you love, man? But we got here, we got this thing, and hopefully it's some terminal tackle in here because I don't have that. And we're going to really just pop it open because we need to see what all lures we can throw tonight, man. Hopefully it goes down, but let's see what we got. And I also want to say, man, I am giving both of these boxes away to one of you guys. Oh, this isn't, it's not any terminal tackle. Mixed three tackle box sent over a Neko. The face mask, man. I'm actually going to give this away to one of y'all. I'm not going to open this thing up. I remember them saying that they were going to send this. Appreciate that, Mr. Tackle Box. I ain't got no terminal tackle. Do you like fishing fat style crane baits or skinny, skinny style crane baits? Better, more. Fat style. Fat you know, style. Skinny one's supposed to have a tight middle kind of bait. It's supposed to be better for like winter. Hmm. I, I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. That's what so, like, you want like a tighter wobble? In the summer, I mean, like a wider wobble in the summer. I got one already, dude. That was too quick, man. The mystery tackle box is going on tonight, y'all. Let's go, bro. Let's go, man. <laughs> I couldn't let I, I couldn't let you do it, man. I was just asking you, what would you rather? What would you rather throw, dog? I guess the big one, man. I guess the big one, y'all. Don't be scared to throw big baits, man. And that's a little guy too, man. You ain't got the trolling motor working yet? My bad, G. <laughs> there we go, man. I think we're gonna actually count this because I thought that was gonna be a hard bait. Let, let's give it two more casts, y'all. Let's give it two more casts. Two more casts and then we're gonna go to the spinner bait because I wanna complete the challenge, but I also wanna see if there's a bigger fish over here. I got one. I got one. Another one. I got one. Oh no! If y'all don't tell me, if y'all tell me that that wasn't a fish, we gonna fight. I think what happened there, y'all. 
I try to set the hook instead of just reeling the bait into his mouth, you know? You don't have to set the hooks with, uh, you don't have to set the hook with a crankbait, man. You can just reel down into him. But I got another bait on there that from the mystery tackle box. This is a bottom bait. That's a smaller presentation. Um, I wanna go with this one. I wanna go with this one, y'all. I wanna go with this one. And actually, since this smaller presentation, bro, it might look funky on my on my spinner bait, but we're gonna put that on there because I don't have a trailer for my spinner bait. So that's gonna have to do. And they got a bass on there, so it should eat it. But got the wave. Salamander, bro. This is what I think it is. Let's look at it. Wow, never mind. It ain't even that. What is it, man? Wave get get bit. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> wave, get bite, get bit. My bad. All right, so let's see how we can hook this thing. Texas rig, wacky, Carolina drop shot, weightless. How do we want to do it? Man, do you have any terminal tackle? Yeah. I, I really do need some of that. Well, we're just going to do the regular Texas rig, y'all. This one? Yeah. Man, my man, atypical. Coming in clutch, man. Look at this, bro. One of these days, I will maybe be this organized. You know what I'm saying? But for right now, we not like this. Look, I even had it upside down. Okay. But I need me, like, this size weight. If you ask me what it is, I don't know. But we're going to use that size weight. Um, Where's the hook that I want? I just saw you, bro. Oh, ow. But those are some sharp hooks now. <laughs> I'm trying to get it out. It's just like a regular three out, four out hook. Here we go. Here we go. Now we're cooking with hot grease. Say it again. Oh, let's get it. For real, no cap. <laughs> Boom. All right, chill. In front of the tree. Why not? you've been doing better on, man. The right side. That side again? I got a fish. That one? I had one, but he dropped it. He was a small one. It wasn't the fish that was, oh, don't fall out the boat. It wasn't nah, the fish we was looking for. That on me. That Leo hasn't always been there, has it? Where? Right there? Yeah. On this bank right there? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I got a big one. Uh -oh. yep. That might be a big one, bro. It might be. Mystery tackle box. Here you go, baby. Oh, it's a decent one, dude. Oh, yeah. He's decent. Right. He's decent, dude. It's the decent one. Ooh, y'all. Let's go. Like a three? Yeah, like a three. Like a three. I'm going to just bring it in. All right. Let's go. Yes, Let's go. <laughs> My man. I love this lake, man. Woo! Don't jump out, baby. The home lake. <laughs> this is my home lake, bro. I put so much time into this place, bro. I put so much time into this lake. People, look, they schooling right there. That's that's uh, bad yeah. schooling now. Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna get this fish. All right, man, I ain't even going to straight up and lie to y'all, man. To y'all, it might be a simple word, but I, my lips can't even pronounce it, bro. But it's like a Castic Alas Atlas spinnerbait that we caught this nice, Look at beautiful. That chunk, y'all. Nice, beautiful. Uh, I say three pounds, right at Big. three pounds, man. On that and that cream creature bait on my trailer, bro. Telling you, I was just slow rolling it through the water column, bro, and... She just came up and picked it up, man. She was not about to let it go. It's only the beginning of this night, man. The night ain't even failed yet, bro. We almost done. Let's get this girl back and get some more, bro. Y'all stay tuned, go. man. Hey, Ripless. Is that you? Disgusting. They really like to be around this flat. Oh, he ate it. I saw, bro. What?
No, but. You got a No, but I'm gonna try to pull this other line out. Yeah. 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 If you want to, we can just go ahead and go over there now. All right. Oh, there's a fish. Oh, dude, that's a fat one. That's a big one. That's a big one. No, it's not. No, it's not. It's, it's, no, it's not. Dude, he hit it so hard. Finally, though, man, it took me a long time to try to get him. Oh. Oh my God, two for one special. Two for one special, my bad, dog. Whoo, my bad, G. Appreciate your help, man. I'm sorry that your rod almost went for a swim. Oh boy, I'm glad that just happened, man. So now we can only focus up on the spinner bait. I'm playing on the Z-Man chatterbait, man. As so y'all here, man, there's a lot of fireworks going on right now. Oh, finally, there we go. I really don't want to put, ow. Yeah. I was about to say that, like I didn't want to hold him in my bad hand. Yeah. And then he just shook. And we back, man. First off, let me just go ahead and say, I appreciate you guys for watching the video, sticking around. And like I said in the beginning of the video, man, I am giving this box away. I've had this box for about two weeks now and I tried it out, went out and fished with it. The first day was not successful. That's why I didn't drag y'all along. But I'm going to go ahead and tell y'all how y'all can enter in this giveaway, man. First, you got to make sure that you subscribe to this channel. Please support me as I'm trying to support you guys. Giving away nice quality lures, man. Uh, it's just the gift to me to you. So please subscribe to the channel. Like this video. Comment down your favorite timestamp on the video. And then next week, I'm going to go live around 7 or 8 p.m. I'll let you guys know on my Instagram. If you guys are not subscribed, if y'all aren't following my Instagram, go over and follow my Instagram, man. It'll be right here so y'all can stay up to date on what's going on, man. So appreciate you guys watching, man. Stay tuned to the next video and all. And as always, man, y'all stay up.